Valentine is a project. We're not sure what happened to her, but she came to us from Baldwin Park Shelter, and when her transport pulled up, she was hiding under the seat. And of course, we thought that was maybe just fear of what she's been through and where she's going, but we can't really get her to come out of her shell. She feels best in her own area, in her own doghouse, and really leery of people she doesn't know. She warms up to other dogs. And if you let her out and other dogs are playing, she smiles and even wags and wants to interact. And she'll pick certain dogs that she feels secure with. And she'll try to play. But if a person approaches, she kind of tucks her tail and wants to go back into her safe house. So she had a really good friend from the beginning, who you see in the video, which is Heather, who befriended her, because Heather helped save her life by arranging all the uh, transportation and things that had to be done at the shelter. So Heather, from the beginning, has brought her this yummy, fresh-cut roast beef from the deli. <laughs> which she really enjoys, as you can see. And Heather's using the roast beef as a tool, of course, to try to coax her to, to come towards her and to feel safer about humans. She's a beautiful girl, as you can see. Uh, just gorgeous. And, and a lot of dogs uh, are like this in life. We, they can't talk to us, and we can only guess and imagine what's happened to them and what they've been through and what's transpired and try to improve their life from that day forward and give them and work with them what they need. She obviously would be a wonderful, wonderful, beautiful companion and pet for the right person that had the patience and the love and the understanding and the depth of caring to give her what she would need. And in the interim, we continue to try to work with her like this. And she's got her best friend Heather here. And she loves that roast beef. <laughs> you like that, Valentine? Oh, isn't Heather so sweet to bring you these special treats? Wow. I'm not going to eat dry kibble tonight when Rhonda feeds it. The thing about her, she doesn't scare you. She doesn't act aggressive. She doesn't growl. She doesn't snarl. She never has to me. Or Heather or anyone expressing interest and in wanting to interact with her. So I'm not afraid of her. We're not afraid of her. She's just shy and introverted. And we can only guess out of something that's happened to her in life. You don't have to be afraid of her. She shows no aggression. She doesn't growl. She doesn't snarl. Kind of puts her head down like that a little bit. Valentine! There's that beautiful face. Look at that pretty face. She has beautiful markings. Valentine! Can you look at Corey? Come here. Oh, hey, Valentine. Did you thank Heather for bringing you all that roast beef? There you are. There you are in your pretty face. Hi, Corey. Here I am. I'm a pretty girl. I just need to come out of my shell. You going to go up to Heather now, honey? You should thank you for bringing all that fresh roast beef meat. Yeah, good thing the other dogs didn't see that. You'd want that for dinner every night, wouldn't you? Oh. 